Hey guys, this is Rich from Rich TV Live, and we have some breaking news from FSD Pharma. FSD Pharma appoints top GW Pharmaceuticals Executive Rupert Haynes as Chief Executive Officer. So this is a company that's really building its management team. FSD Pharma Inc., otherwise known as HUGE, H-U-G-E on the CNSX, on the OTCQB under the symbol FSDDF, and in Frankfurt, Germany under the symbol OK9 announced today the appointment of Rupert Hayes as Chief Executive Officer. Mr. Haynes is a highly accomplished healthcare executive with nearly three decades of global pharmaceutical experience, having most recently held the position of Head of Global Marketing at GW Pharmaceuticals, GWPH, on the NASDAQ in the United Kingdom. In his new role with FSD Pharma, Mr. Haynes will continue to work out of the United Kingdom which will support FSD Pharma's strategy of expanding its global footprint. Interim CEO and co-chairman of the board, Dr. Raza Bukhari, will remain in place as CEO until Mr. Haynes officially assumes the role. Mr. Haynes has an impressive track record in pipeline and product development, which is directly relevant to FSD's vision of becoming a global cannabinoid-based pharmaceutical leader, said Dr. Raza Bukhari, co-chairman of the board. He blends world-class specialty pharmaceutical experience with a fast-paced biotech mindset that will help accelerate FSD's growth and global expansion strategy by assembling a top-tier management team and pursuing targeted mergers and acquisitions. On behalf of the board, I welcome him to the company. As head of the global marketing at GW Pharmaceuticals, Mr. Haynes oversaw the strategic development of the firm's cannabinoid portfolio, including numerous cannabinoid pipeline products across dozens of therapeutic areas, but primarily neurological, neurodegenerative, and neuropsychological conditions. Mr. Haynes was also involved in the strategic planning and development of Epid. Eolix are an FDA-approved cannabinoid oil for the treatment of seizures associated with Lennox, Gasto syndrome, or Dravet syndrome. Before GW, Mr. Haynes held numerous commercial roles, including senior leadership positions at both Large Pharma and Bespoke, bespoke biotech firms, which include Sobe, UCB Pharma, Bristol Myers, Squibb Limited UK, and Pharmacia, and Upjohn Limited UK. This is an exciting time to be joining FSD Pharma, said Rupert Hayes, CEO of FD, FSD Pharma. The company is advancing at a rapid pace, having recently announced a pilot study for SCN001 in irritable bowel syndrome through its collaboration with SICAN and intention to acquire Therapix Biosciences where there are active clinical trials evaluating cannabinoid combination therapies. I look forward to continuing this fast-paced pharmaceutical development, which could lead to multiple significant new development programs in a very short time frame. In October 2018, FSD announced its intention to acquire Therapix Biosciences to develop novel cannabinoid combination therapies in pain, migraine, and other CNS disorders. Therapix is currently evaluating THX-110, a proprietary combination drug based on drinabinol and PEA. In two ongoing phase two studies in Tourette syndrome, Yale University Medical Center and obstructive sleep apnea, Asuta Medical Center with a planned phase two initiation in chronic back pain. FSD partner, Cycan Therapeutics, a company developing novel cannabinoid products for a range of diseases, recently announced initiation of a pilot study evaluating Cycan's proprietary steady stomach cannabinoidal combination product for the treatment of irritable bowel, bowel syndrome patients. We look forward to having Mr. Haynes at the helm of FSD as the company expands into the pharmaceutical industry, said Anthony Durkic, co-chairman of the board of founder. And board, the board believes that Mr. Haynes' track record of product and pipeline development leadership on both a regional and international level will support the tr transition of FSD into a global leader in the cannabinoid-based pharmaceutical space. Love this. Love this. 
This is such a great company. Mr. Haynes appointed as chief executive officer builds on the incredible momentum at FSD Pharma this year, said Zishan Saeed, president and founder. We believe Mr. Haynes brings the vision and know-how to create long-term value for investors and new effective treatments for conditions where there remains a need for the therapeutic alternatives about FSD Pharma. FSD Pharma is focused on the development and highest quality indoor grown pharmaceutical grade cannabis and on the research and development of novel cannabinoid based treatments for several central nervous system disorders, including chronic pain, fibromyalgia, and irritable bowel syndrome. The company's phase one growth plan involves the development of 25,000 square feet of indoor grow space at its Ontario facility and an additional 220,000 square feet which pending approval by Health Canada is expected to be operational in the first quarter of 2019, which is right around the corner. FSD facilities sit on 72 acres of land and 40 acres prime for development and expansion capacity up to 3.896 million square feet. FSD fully wholly owned subsidiary FV Pharma is a licensed producer of cannabis, having received its cultivation license under the Access of Cannabis for Medical Purposes Regulations, ACMPR, on October 13, 2017, and is now operating under the recently enacted Cannabis Act. FV Pharma Vision is to transform its current headquarters in a craft plant in Coburg, Ontario, into the greatest hydroponic indoor grow facility in the world. FV Pharma intends to cover all aspects of this exciting new industry, including cultivation, legal, processing, manufacturing, extracts, and research and development. What do you think about this news? This is a company that just continues to add to its team. I personally own 19,000 shares of FSD Pharma, and I think this bad boy has huge potential. The only problem that I have with this company is the amount of shares. They got too many shares. That's what worries me about this company. Way too many shares. CEOs, CFOs, hey guys, you guys keep getting joined to this board. Why don't you do something about the shares? If you need to learn what to do about the shares, holler at your boy. I can show you how to reduce the shares. I can show you how to buy back shares. I can show you how to just shrink your shares, guys. There's too many shares. This is why the stock won't go up. If you want the stock to go up, holler at your boy. We can put together a cocktail of alternatives that will reduce your share structure and make this bad boy fly. I ain't the CEO and CFO, but you're adding all these guys. If you really want to make it fly, holler at your boy. If you're not winning, you're not watching. Remember, Rich TV Live is strictly for education and entertainment purposes. We just bring you the news. Don't kill the messenger boy, okay? I can't control the stock. I don't own the company. But if I did, I'd be doing something about that 1 billion plus shares, which is the reason why the stock's not going up, all right? That's the only reason. You reduce the amount of shares and watch the bad boy fly. All right. I'm out. Big news. Holler at your boy. Peace. Hit that like button. Share the video everywhere. Subscribe for more updates. Hit that bell for notifications. This is your boy Rich. And I'm out. FSD Pharma. Big news. Peace.